loves, it's Devin, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. If you've noticed any of my videos lately, you'll see that I have a ton of hauls, fashion hauls, and I've said this before, it may look like I'm addicted to shopping or going through it, but actually I'm just rebuilding my closet because I was going through it and purchased a lot of clothes that weren't really me and I just never wore, didn't like. Some I had for so long, it was just time to get rid of them, which I donated like a ton of bags. I've said this a, a lot of times. I don't want anyone to think I throw out any of my clothes. I don't, I donate them or find a friend or somebody that wants them. So a lot of the other videos that I have posted were neutrals and basics because I do also want to have more of a capsule wardrobe, something that will last me a long time and give me many different outfits with one. But today's video is going to be more of things that I really, really wanted, more of like my dream items that I felt like are things that are popular right now but also classic so let's start with a brand I have never purchased before but I see her stuff all over Instagram she has the iconic heart necklace got something a little more classic and the brand is Vanessa Mooney if you didn't know already and I got a newer release item this is a pearl pearl and metal I not clasp. I don't know what it's called. I'll link it down below. I cannot think of what it is, but basically half pearl, half this metal necklace. It is really beautiful. I am pretty impressed overall with it. It's very sturdy and actually like, I feel like it's pretty good quality for being like plated. So very happy about this. It's super cute. I love pearls and I just feel like this was cute having the two sidedness of it. So I'm really happy with it. I really like it. Definitely a dream purchase of mine. Anything pearls and gold. Gold is my favorite. So definitely love this. Next item is something that I actually didn't have or didn't have a pair that fit me that I think they're classic. Is it super dreamy and like, ah, like amazing? No, but it's definitely part of the capsule wardrobe-ish that we got going on. And that is a pair of black slacks from Zara. So these are really great quality. These are a size small. Again, I'll link it down below because you don't wanna navigate the Zara website. It's way too difficult. The only thing with these slacks are that they're huge, like a way too big. Definitely not for the petite girls. I do have to get them hemmed, which I'm bummed about because I can't wear them yet, but I really love these. And I think there's just so many different ways that you can wear black slacks either a bit more casual or dressed up. So I'm really happy about this. I've really wanted a pair of these, especially from Zara for a long time. Next up is the dreamiest of all dreamy items. This definitely was on my vision board for like my dream wardrobe. It had been sold out for a very long time and all of a sudden it was back in stock. Is the Princess Polly Penny Lane pink faux leather and fur coat. Um, girl, she is the moment. I'm absolutely obsessed. Pink is definitely one of my favorite colors and I saw a friend of mine on Instagram wear this. She goes by the Ashley Clark. I'll post her so you can follow. She has a very dreamy, soft, girly aesthetic, which I love. And I absolutely fell in love with this coat when I saw her in it. I love that it's more of a muted pink. I really tend to like baby pink or pastels, just kind of soft tones. This kind of was a lot of money, but not really. If you're 
familiar with Princess Polly, like you can always find a discount code. So I did and yes, definitely very happy with this. This is for sure an item that was up high on there of my dream wardrobe and I feel like a rich stepmom coming to pick you up in my topless beamer with my Chanel glasses sipping on an Americano like kids get in the car let's go those are the vibes it gives me and I'm here for it and I love it I put this on and my mom also was like ah! Like, where are you gonna wear that to? And I was like, <laughs> Trader Joe's, where else? Another item that has definitely been on my list for my dream wardrobe has been a really cute, chunky pair of loafers. I have tried a bunch of different ones from ASOS to Princess Polly, a, a lot of different ones. They're either too cheap or too big and don't fit. But I actually was surprised that I found this beautiful pair from Ink, INC. Not sure it's the Macy's brand or whatever, which I feel like is usually kind of cheaper. But these definitely weren't that cheap and they look like really good quality. I love the thick gold chain. I think they're so cute because they're not too chunky. Some of the other ones that I tried on were so chunky that they just looked a little bit more edgy rocker, which I do also appreciate. But at the same time, I wanted something that I could just wear with skirts and be a little bit more like preppy. So I definitely love these. They're so cute. My feet are small, but they're also wide so I have a hard time finding shoes these are a six and they're very comfy and I also believe they're vegan like synthetic not real leather which I liked and yeah very happy with these I just think there's so many different outfits you can wear it to I feel like I'm very late on the loafer train also I'm fine with it because I do think that this trend is kind of still going and really I don't care I'm overdoing whatever is trendy and if it's not trendy anymore oh well I still love these so definitely happy that I added them to my collection so I've actually worn this sweater a few times in other videos and posted pictures with it but I did want to share because it definitely was part of my dream wardrobe and the style and aesthetic that I'm going for this is a really soft sweater and it's by the brand Chu. So I did get this from Yes Style, which I'm kind of not shopping on as much anymore, but this was like part of the last purchase that I bought. I do have a coupon code. I guess I'll link it below if you want to use it, if you like to shop at Yes Style. It's just so hit or miss for me that I haven't really like been feeling it lately, but the last items that I bought were all from Chu, which I had purchased from before. They are a little pricier, but on Yes Style, they're a little cheaper. So I just really love this style. I don't know what you would call it, but it's one of my favorites and it always has been. I like that this is kind of like tweed, like the tweed set vibes, but it's not tweed, it's sweat, it's like soft sweater material. I love the pearl details, pearls are like my favorite. Then they have some, some like texture around the pearl detail buttons also. So this is definitely one of my favorite purchases. I think it also came in ivory, which honestly, there's cat hair on it. I buy the ivory too because I did buy a tweed skirt from H&M in kind of like this ivory color so I feel like it'll match really well but yeah just overall this is like the vibes I'm going for to add so definitely happy with it. Another item on my list for my dream wardrobe has been this faux leather jacket. I did want to add like a different style leather to my faux leather you know outfits and so I love this kind of more trenchy coat feel this I got at Nordstrom Rack not too happy about the silver detail buttons but it is what it is it's harder to find clothing items with gold so silver it is but yeah I love this jacket I feel like it's so cute with jeans pants skirts and boots like anything overall you can also get a lot of outfits out of this puffer jackets have been like huge lately and I guess in South Korea they're very very popular I was reading this article that like every fashion egg girl there has like a black long puffer jacket so 
I bought it. Also, puffer jackets have been super popular in the US as well. Different colors like the tans and the faux leather. I did get a puffer vest from Abercrombie, which was really cute. But I did want just like a long, thick, black, puffer jacket so I found this at Uniqlo which I really like they have like a lot of good basics and they have the best like anime tees when they come out with different drops or just like Disney drops like their t-shirts are just super cute like if you don't know about Uniqlo you should get on it very cute love them for jacket I definitely don't know if I like need it for California unless I was going up to the mountains because it's very thick, it's very insulated. The arms are nice because they are tighter like around the cuffs and you can see it has like this almost insulated material in it. I couldn't pass this up because it was on sale. I'll try to find the link and link it below if it's still there. But I mean, I got this for ridiculously cheap. Uniqlo has amazing sales when they have sale stuff. And I think it was right around Christmas so they had like a code to get more off of their sale stuff. So that's why I got it. Cause I feel like one day I'll definitely need this in my life. So I had never purchased anything from this fashion brand before, but I did for my boyfriend and I really wanted something for myself that is Comme des Garçons. So this was actually in the men's section and this t-shirt was a good amount of money for a t-shirt, but I love this brand and I really wanted a pair of the Converse slash play by Comme des Garçons shoes, which I got for my boyfriend in white, so I think it's my turn, and uh, that's the next thing I wanna add to my dream collection. But I can't decide what color, if I want white, pink, or black. In the meantime, I did wanna add a t-shirt by this brand that I could wear with slacks. I think this would be really cute with my Zara slacks, with like the leather jacket over, or honestly, anything I think that it's nice for just a t-shirt obviously and it can definitely be dressed up but i just love the little heart face it's so cute so this was a medium i did try on a size small again this was in the men's section i saw it i was like ah, i need it so i tried on a small and it fit but it definitely was snug and i didn't want to risk it shrinking so i decided to get it in medium okay so i have one more item that i just got in the mail that definitely is the book end to this video and to my dream wardrobe so let me grab it it actually came like right after I had finished filming this so I definitely want to add it because I had it in mind when I was thinking of what items really would complete my dream wardrobe and what I wanted so the box came really smashed but it's what's inside that matters I got this from Saks Fifth Avenue. They actually had a really, really big sale online, so I was really excited to see this. I've never purchased anything from this brand before, but I love all their stuff and their aesthetic. This is the brand Sandro Paris, and this is a little pink with purple detail cardigan. There is pearl buttons. It's just super dreamy, and I absolutely love it. So let's try it on so you can see how beautiful it is. incredibly blessed to be able to buy the things that I buy. I do have a few items that are more designer and luxury. I actually have a long list of designer luxury items that I do want to get, which I don't think I'll get them all this year at all. But, you know, a girl can dream, right? <coughs> Leave me a comment down below and let me know what a piece of your dream wardrobe is. Maybe I need to, you know, add it to mine. Just kidding, just kidding. I'm maxed out. <laughs> But yeah, leave me a comment down below. While you're at it, like and subscribe. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.